uh, welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be doing another Netflix review and this review is on um, a series of unfortunate events the second season and I um, did do a review on the first season which I'll put down in the description bar below and in the second season um, um, kicks off from where the first season's um, finished from so basically it's doing I think I believe it was the 5th to like the 10th I believe um the 5th and the 10th book I believe it was so the first one was based on the first four books um and uh they're kind of like filming on the third one which there will be it will be when it does come out so it just basically like I said it left left off from where the um, left off from where we we left in the first season. So, like I said, I can't remember what's in the last review, but anyway, I like how they kept it with the same theme with the dark lighting, the dark scenery, everything. Since it is a series of unfortunate events and it's a kind of a dark story to it, that was great and awesome. Um, the camera work, everything, it's great. Neil Patrick Harris is awesome as um counter Olaf and how he does all these different characters and impressions and everything um what I this is what I think I think it was the second last episode um of the thing where the where the all the layers go to the um to the uh to the the carnival um and the turn to the freaks it gave me the um it reminded me so much those um, that episode in particular reminded me so much of the movie the greatest showman just because of the f aspects of the freaks as in this episode and also with the freaks use of um that violent violence in the um movie and also the whole circus part of the whole um the circus part of this singing with Count Olaf and other thing reminded me of the Come Alive um, song in the um, the movie The Greatest Showman, which is a really awesome correlation between both the movie and the the episode. Um, so yeah, overall it was an awesome series to watch. So it's over. There's one more season, so I'm happy to see them. what they come up with with the last few books in the um series. And this is my theory. So now how we're so in the my the, there is some spoilers if you haven't seen it. So this part where they're um oh unless you've seen the book, then you kind of know what happens. Um, so basically the part where they find out that. The one pets probably survived the fire was um you know in the uh, the I think it's the fourth episode where they have the in auction and um the Baudelaire's managed to find a a uh, underground a hole and a tunnel and they managed to far get out and through another uh, escape but they managed to come up and turned out to be their burnt home so what I believe from this taking that scene from that episode and bringing it up from the eventually on the planet surviving was I believe it was the mum and what happened was the fire occurred the dad died and the mum escaped through the under, underground tunnel so that's my theory from the um one parent surviving so yeah so that's my theory so that is all for my review for this week and i'll see you next week with a new video see you then bye